Hi there! So the legendary Firestar Dragon is the new monthly dragon in DML. He is a brand new, never before seen dragon with the legendary light and energy elements. You only have the month of July 2018 to breed him and he may never return to DML ever again. And so today I'll be giving you the four best combinations you can use to breed him. So. If you want to have a chance at breeding the Firestar Dragon, you have to breed together two dragons that have the fire, wind, earth, and plant elements. Of course, that means there are hundreds of different breeding combinations you could use, but I've cut it down to the four that give you the highest odds while using relatively easy dragons to breed. So, the best combination that I would suggest for you to use this month would be the orange plus wind dragons, and they're both relatively easy dragons to get a hold of. But, when you breed these two together, we have one, two, three, four, five, six other possible outcomes, but even though there are six outcomes, most of their breeding times are pretty short, the longest being 12 hours on the tribal dragon. So. Overall, you're going to have around about a 3% chance to breed the Firestar Dragon with this combo. So overall, this is the best combination. I highly suggest to use it. But if you don't have the Orange and Wind Dragons to use, then another absolutely amazing combination that you can use is the Tribal Plus Plant Dragons. And of course, just like with all combinations, if I suggest a dragon like the Tribal, you can use any dragon that has the same elements as him and you can replace him and the combination will work just the same. So you can use the Tribal plus Plant, the Prairie plus Plant, or any dragon that has Fire, Earth and Wind and breed that with the plant and it will give you the same odds. But this combination here is really good because it only has four possible outcomes. The only problem with it is that most of their breeding times are relatively long. 6 hours minimum, 16 hours being the longest breeding time. But this gives like a 3.5 to 4% chance of breeding the Firestar Dragon at base. So overall this is still a really good combo. And the third best combination that I would suggest for you to use this month would be the Academic plus fire dragons. So the academic and the other dragons with the same types or elements are kind of difficult to get a hold of, but this combination is still pretty good, giving one, two, three, four, five, six possible outcomes with relatively short breeding times, but you can still breed the orange and tribal dragons, so the first combination is still a little bit better than this one. But if you're someone that doesn't have any epics, any rares, any three element dragons, which, you know, some of us don't, don't worry, because we do have a breeding combination for you as well. And so the final combo that I would suggest for you to use if you don't have any of those epics is the smoke plus tree dragons. And so this one has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight possible outcomes. So. Your chances are lower, around 2.5% to breed the Firestar, and some of the breeding times are relatively long, because you've got the orange, the sunflower, the tribal, but still a good combination to use if you're a relatively new player, so those are the recommended combos for breeding the Firestar this month. Oh, and if you were wondering, the breeding time for the Firestar Dragon is two days normally reduced to one day and 14 hours with VIP. So that means you'll be able to tell instantly if you've bred him or not. And to increase your chances of breeding the Firestar Dragon, I'd suggest leveling up your breeding dragons to level 15 minimum. Leveling up your orange and wind dragons won't guarantee the breed will be successful, but it will increase your odds slightly, so it's worth it in the long run. But don't go too crazy with the levels though, I'd say level 30 should be the absolute max you ever level them up to. But the very best thing you can do to increase your chances of breeding the legendary Firestar Dragon is to rebreed as many times as you possibly can. Most of your attempts will end in failure, giving you the 12 hour breeding time for the tribal or the 6 hour breeding time for the seed, but just rebreed, rebreed, and rebreed some more until you finally see that two day breeding time. So, those are the main things you need to know about breeding this legendary. 
don't forget you can also buy the second breeding den if you are really struggling to breed him, but I'll just be using the singular breeding den myself. But anywho, let me know whether you bred him or not and which combination you used. You can share all your Dragon Mania legends and other gaming related stuff in our Discord server. So it's free, so you can check it out without any worries and come and chat. So the link for that will be in the video description. But thanks so much for watching today and leave a like if this helped you out. For now though, I'm going to get back to breeding and recording, so I'll be back very soon with more vids.